you would have mentioned CMO or certain settings which the masks would be recommended. So like in the supermarkets, in the cinemas and public transport. Um, but now it's just a recommendation. With any policy now, do, is it legal for somebody, a business owner or any of these people to say, hey, what I want to make sure to make sure that everybody that's coming into my establishment has that mask on and where is that mask? Is that something allowed? So thanks for the question, Richard. So let's take the first question, which we addressed last week and we have been addressing time and time again about the authority of business places to determine who comes in by law, as we said, a business place, and you will see the signs, a business place can determine who comes in. You will see signs saying no sleeveless, no hats, no barefoot, no short pants. And this has been cleared by the Attorney General that any business place has the authority to determine whether someone comes into their establishment with a mask or without a mask. Uh, can we have an update on our preparations for monkeypox? Because I know there was some stuff such as the building capacity for genetic sequencing, um, local testing capacity, as well as getting smallpox vaccines for, uh, um, for the population that were kind of being worked on. On the issue of monkeypox preparedness, between May 20th and today, um, we on May 20th we started our monkeypox preparedness um, when I convened a meeting with PAHO, CAFA, Ministry of Health. Coming out of that meeting we did put out a press release that same day alerting persons of what steps they can take. We also put up a hyperlink for people to go on to to check the countries which are continuously updated as to where monkeypox has been discovered. Um, the latest PAHO WHO summary as of 9th July, so this is 9th July, says um, between 1st January and, yeah, between 1st January and 7th July 2022, that's the period they were look, looking at, there were a total of 7,892 confirmed cases the vast majority of which are in Europe. In the Trinidad and Tobago context, I did indicate back then that we were looking at local and regional testing capacity. CAFA has the capacity and has been testing uh, samples from the CARICOM region, um, in, but we have not sent any samples to be tested as yet because we have no suspected cases. 